While summer might be on the way out, the hot temperatures definitely are not. Our Marguerite and Cardoni shares a few tools the community has to beat the heat. While today's high temperature is predicted to reach 89 degrees, Greater Lafayette is expected to reach temperatures closer to 100 later this week. Lafayette Urban Ministry is providing a cooling shelter to those who need it. Of course, we're operating our shelter every night for those who are unhoused. So we have a 46 bed facility that's air conditioned so people can get in safe and get a good night of sleep. We're also opening up our office during the day from 8.15 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. The National Weather Service has issued an excessive heat watch taking effect tomorrow morning. Wes Tillett is the director of Lafayette Urban Ministry. We've got a number of chairs set up here. We can easily accommodate 25, 30 people at any given time, but we usually just have people kind of come in and out during the day, cool off for an hour or two and move on. Extreme heat significantly increases the risk of heat related illnesses, especially to those outside. Officials recommend drinking plenty of fluids and staying indoors and out of the sun. Lafayette Urban Ministry is happy to help anyone who needs it. That's the remarkable thing about helping people, right? Like when you help people, you actually receive something yourself. It's always a, a blessing to be a blessing to others. Officials from Lafayette School Corporation and Tippecanoe School Corporation say that the schools are limiting time outdoors for students. Marching band and outdoor sports are moving practices indoors while providing frequent water breaks and cooling towels. Wes wants other entities in the community to do what they can to help people in need during the heat. We encourage other businesses, churches, whoever uh, is open to uh, receiving people that need to get in and out of the heat during the day to to do that, utilize the resource that they have and, and be hospitable. The National Weather Service has issued an excessive heat watch for Tippecanoe County beginning on Wednesday that is in effect until midnight on Friday. Marguerite Incardoni, Star City News, Lafayette.